It's beer o'clock on Real Ale Craft Beer. Today we've got a beer from Hiver and it's a bottle of their Honey Ale. It's coming in at 4.5% ABV and it's been described as a brown ale brewed with raw British honeys. Red bottle cap on this one. Let's get the beer out into a glass and see what we get. Nice bit of smoke on the opening. Beer in the glass. I've had this beer a few months. I've decided to kind of let the honey in the just let the beer mature for a little bit. As a brown ale, it, it, it's not hugely important to drink it fresh like some of the IPAs that are out there in the world. So I just thought with that lovely kind of brown ale and the honey, let it mold together. Give it a few months to kind of age nicely. Not too long, it's only 4.5% ABV. We don't want to age it over a year because um, it will just fade and die. But I think I've kind of, well, you can see by the carbonation that after a few months, it's still got a lot of life to it. A nice golden, it's not golden really, is it? It's, a, it's an amber, a deep amber colour, very clear, one finger, white head. Let's get the aroma. Oh, I really do get the honey in the beer. Lots of sweet honey, like you've kind of, my, my daughters, my kids put a spoonful of honey on their Weetabix and they asked me to do it for them and I kind of do it and and I'm not really a honey fan in eating it raw, I, I'm just not a fan of it. But um, I can I can smell that kind of honey that they pour in their breakfast cereal on the, in, in the beer. Along with that biscuity malty aroma in the beer. Let's dive into this one, cheers. Mm. It's subtle, but then it's not all at the same time. I'm talking about the honey. As I said the word subtle, it kind of bounded on my palate, the, the, the honey on the back end. It's a sweet, kind of slightly sticky feel. And it's just lovely. It really is lovely. With the with the bready malt, it kind of mixes in, it kind of moulds in well. It's a nice addition to the beer. Carbonation tickles on the tongue as you as you sip the beer. That helps to promote the flavours in the beer, that malt, that bread, that biscuit, that kind of caramel flavour. Slightly sweet there, and then the honey, that lovely kind of sticky sweet honey flavour, and then a little bit of bitterness on the back end. It's a very well put together beer, I do like this. So a lovely aroma then, you get a big, you get more of the aroma of the honey in, in the aroma than you do in the taste. So you get, sorry, I, I should say, you get more of the, the, the feel of the honey in the aroma than you do the taste. We got that right. So I suppose the best thing to do is actually kind of exhale and then breathe in as you're drinking the beer. And then you get the whole experience of this very well put together beer. I do like it. That's Hiver, the honey ale. A brown ale brewed with raw British honeys. Um, Hiver specialises in honey beer and uses only British ingredients and suppliers to produce our craft beers. Uh, for this brown ale, we ferment raw blossom and heather honeys to complement and add depth to darker roasted malts. A light hop bitterness finishes a flavour of an unpasteurised brown ale. Honey and beer, what's not to love? I like it. I like it a lot. That's Hiver the honey beer. Let's give it a rating. I'm going to give this beer, I'm going to give it, I reckon I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10. It's an 8 out of 10 from Real Craft Beer. Go out and try it. Please comment, please subscribe and cheers.